Hello, I'm Richard with EV for You Custom Conversions. And today we're going to talk about uh, another product line that we uh, offer, and that is uh, battery backup systems. Uh, we did a video before talking about our uh, emergency uh, battery backup power supplies. And so we offer these uh, lithium iron phosphate. Uh, battery uh, backup power supplies. Basically it's a battery pack combined with an inverter to provide power for whatever purposes, whether you're on a remote location or you, uh, you have a power outage, whatever. We have one at all of our locations. Uh, this particular uh, warehouse, we have a 12.8 kilowatt hour with a 6,000 watt inverter. It's uh, 3,000 watts continuous, and that's uh, enough to do whatever we need to do in the workshop if the power were to go out. Uh, we're fairly fortunate this location. We have underground utilities, and uh, even when the uh, utilities have has had uh, uh, outages due to uh, you know fires and so forth, this location has been one that has stayed live. So we're fortunate for that, but we're prepared for the, the times when the power does go out. But in this video, I wanted to show you something uh, a little different. Like I said, we make these backup uh, power supplies. They're custom made per the, the customer's uh, you know, uh, desires. So based on the, uh, their requirements, we size the battery pack, we size the inverter, so forth. Well. So for a warehouse like this, where we don't have a lot of uses, you know, we have a, a small one uh, and that you can roll around. Well, this trailer behind me, this is uh, our enclosed car trailer. And so when it goes to the race uh, track and stuff, it's nice to have uh, power for, for lighting, uh, to, to charge your, your battery operated tools, um, and to run, you know, microwave oven, so you can, you know, warm up some lunch or whatever. It 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 it, it can handle all that, um, and we'll take a look at it in just a second. But it's a, it's a battery pack um, that is uh, in a box. It weighs about 100 pounds. You can move it to a vehicle, another trailer, uh, wherever and it's mated in the trailer with a 2000 watt inverter and it has 400 uh, watts of solar on the roof and so basically we never charge this thing uh, with anything other than solar and it's always ready to go so we'll go inside and take a look at it and i'll give you some more specs on the battery uh, battery pack okay here it is um, that's a piece of foam on the outside there and um, we also usually cover the ratchet right there um, but it just sits on top of the fender in other words it's the same width as the fender you can see so it doesn't stick out any further with the exception of the uh, of our ratchet um, but it's just like I said, it's, it's just temporary. It's just uh, mounted in the trailer. And we have um, our, our terminals here, negative and positive. We have a switch with a key, so we can turn it off and move the switch. And, um, and so it's connected to our solar charge controller as well as our inverter right here. And uh, so it connects to all of the uh, wire that goes to the trailer right there. So these two connections right here, these two terminal strips, positive and negative, go down the battery. So we got two connections coming off the battery. One that goes to the trailer and one that goes to the inverter. And basically four bolts and the inverter comes out and it can go with the trailer. Um, and so this is a um, 4.8 kilowatt hour um, battery. So it's 
plenty of power for this type of use. Um, it's got instrumentation on it so you can see what um, you know what the voltage is, what the current draw is, or what the amount of current going into the pack, um, as well as the state of charge. Um, it also has some built on, it's got a couple USB ports here, as well as a, a 12 volt power port that are built onto it. And then like you saw, it's got the two terminals on the side for power out. Now the difference between this and a lot of, uh, you know, there's things out there on the market now, there's tons of them. And um, the difference between most of those is, is the power capable. This is a battery pack that we can use for just about anything that requires at 12 volts. Um, because this is the nominal voltage on this is 13.2 volts and it's 360 amp hours and it has the ability to put out um, well it can put out a thousand amps continuously okay if if you have you know you can see what we have here is sized based on the on the load requirements but these cells uh, individually um, have the ability to put out 540 amps continuously, 1800 for 10 seconds. So this has a lot of capability. You can use this to jump start a vehicle. You can use it to power anything you need to power. Um, the only limitation is you know, the storage capability. It's got the, the, the power output that more than you'll need for any for anything just about. And then in the trailer itself we have additional uh, power ports here, both USB and, uh, and, and the 12 volt power sockets. Um, and if you're working in the trailer or whatever, uh, we have a solar charge controller and um, like I said, to, to charge the thing. But we also have uh, cameras on the trailer that allow you to see what's going on outside. Um, if you're in here uh, working on a project or something. Um, we also have power ports on this side. And so, and one of them switched right here, this lower 12 volt port switched this is a couple USBs right here so you know if you got a bunch of people that are uh, you know working with you at the track and so forth they need to charge phones or tablets or whatever this this is more than enough to, to do that and it's small enough that you could put this in the bed of a pickup or whatever and like I said it's uh, it's perfect for this trailer because it sits on the, uh, the, the fender well here and it uh, doesn't take up any more room and we just tie it down in place. This particular battery box spends most of its life right here but like I said it's just strapped in so we can just basically unbolt those um, uh, cable connections and unstrap it and away it goes. Anyway just wanted to show you, you know, uh, one of the other, you know, products that we offer, but also something that you can do yourself uh, using, you know, same components that are used in, in an EV. And so um, we have, like I said, the switch right here. I flip this switch. Boom. That shuts off the power and uh, everything goes dark. And it will... That, that little light will go out in a moment too. Um, flip the switch, and everything's back on. So anyway, uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions about any of our products or services, or questions about doing your own project, um, 
don't don't leave a question on the YouTube channel. Send it to info at evforyounow.com and we'd be happy to help you.